All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome. My name is Ellen. This is uh, Fit in February. We're offering workouts every day uh, for the month of February. And this is our first live Zoom session, bar school. It's going to be about 20 minutes. You don't need any bar uh, background. It is a blend of yoga, Pilates, and some dance. We're going to get a great workout. You're going to feel your muscles burning. And you're going to use a chair for today's workout. Make sure it's sturdy wherever you have it, um, and then optional lightweight. Okay, so I'm going to share my music because Bar lets you go to the beat of the music and have it as a background. So let me do that, and then I'll ask for the thumbs up to make sure that you all can hear it and hear me as well. So let me start it. All right, so I'm going to back up. Can you hear the music and hear me? Just give me a thumbs up. And we'll be all set to go. Awesome. Thank you. So with any workout, take it at your own pace. I'm actually going to move my chair here. We will come back to that. We're going to go ahead and start with a nice little warm-up. Again, bar sculpt. Inhale, reach those arms up. Exhale, take it down. Inhale, reach up. Exhale. Let's do that a couple more times. Inhale up. And exhale. Do it again. Inhale. And two more times. Good deep breath in. Exhale it out. One more. Good. A couple shoulder rolls. Up and back. We're going to bring those feet together. You're going to do one more big shoulder roll. Then I want you to take your arms in front of you. Imagine you're holding a beach ball. We're going to march in place. Go ahead and lift. So imagine you're holding that beach ball. You're lifting your legs one at a time, keeping that core nice and tight here. We go. So back is nice and straight. Just marching in place, getting that warm up. Keep it up. I'm just going to show you from the side. You keep moving here. Lift. We're going to add some arms to this to get a little bit warmer. Reach and pull. Nice and tall. Chest on top of those hips. Let's add a twist right here. The bar is nice and low impact. We start just with a tiny bit of cardio to get us warm. Let's do eight more. Eight. Six. Really twist here. Four, three, two, and one. All right, bring those feet nice and wide again. We're going to come down into a nice sumo squat. Two counts down. Down. For two, arms out. And then up for two. Down. And up. So imagine you're holding that beach ball. Right? Tuck those hips. Now yeah, let's do it again. Down. Two. And up. One more slow. Now let's go tempo. Down and up. We're going to add arms. Open when you lift up. Close when you come back down. So here's sort of that dance component of bar. Working on that posture. Squeezing your shoulder blades together. Four. Three, two, hold this one up here, lower for three counts. Three, two, one, lift back up. Three, two, nice and slow on the way down. Keep that back flat. One more like that. Now tempo again, drop. Keep the arms here. Shoulders down. Maybe get a little bit lower. Stone those legs. And maybe still on those arms too. Yeah, good. Last one, stay right here. Just pull. We're just gonna pull. Now, if you want a little bit more, you could grab those lightly. You could also just stick to body weight. Little pulses here. Shoulders down. Four, three, two. We're gonna now add a row. Drop and row. Squat and row. So warming up the upper body. 
So we also get a little bit of resistance training with bar, right? Working those muscles. Good, last one. Now let's drop and stay low. Do that pulse, I want you to add just a row here. We'll start with that right arm, this row. Right, let's switch, left. Still keeping that pulse in the leg. Let's do it again. Pull and pull. Keep the core nice and strong. This can be with very light weights or no weights at all. Four, three, two. Get ready to flip those palms. Flip, let's come all the way up. And once you squeeze and pull your shoulder blades together. Up, squeeze, do that again. Down and lift. One more. So now we're feeling those biceps. Drop and hold. Woo, light weights, because we're gonna feel this. Pulse with the legs. Let's add a bicep curl. Right and switch left. One at a time. Curl. Try to keep those elbows above your shoulders. Woo. So a lot of pulses in bar. Light weights through this body weight. We've got four. Three, get a little lower, two, feel that bird. Oh my goodness, come on up. Great job, let's hit the back of our arms. We're gonna lean forward slightly, hinge at the waist. We're gonna work the back of the arms, and again, with weight or without. Neck is nice and long. Lift and lower. Let's start with a lift. Lift and lower, six straight arms. I want you to squeeze the back of the arms just a little bit. And those hands should be higher than those hips. That's where you're going to really feel those triceps. Let's go tempo. Lift. Lift a little faster. Lift. See how six straight my arms are. Lift. And lift. Keep going. Bones is changing. We don't stop. Lift. And lift. Now I want you to add a kick. You're going to lift and a kick. It's just a small bend in those elbows. Almost like you're straightening them out. Lift, kick, lift, and kick. Who's still those triceps now? Woo, it's a small movement, but a big burn. Keep it up. Lift, and kick. Four, three, keep that neck long. Two, find your highest point and just pulse. Highest point and pulse, 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 pulse. Lift a little higher. Eight, seven, pull, six, arms straight. Four, three, two, and one. Woo, great job. Let's put those weights down if you're using them. Okay, so we're gonna now use that chair. Okay, we're gonna use it for a plank. So just make sure your chair is steady. If you don't have one, you can do this on the floor. It's gonna warm up that core before we hit the lower body. Come down onto those forearms. Nice, straight body. You're gonna hold this plank. Just hold it right here with me. You can also be supported with knees on the floor. Find it and hold it. Keep breathing. Hold it. Tuck those hips under just a little bit. We gotta hold it for eight more counts. Eight, seven, Six, five, four, three. Then we're gonna lift those hips up two counts. Lift up for two and lower back down. Up for two and lower back down. Lift and lower. Lift and lower. Throw the bucket down, dog. Lift and lower. One more. Lift. Find your plank and hold. Hold it, hold it, squeeze those inner thighs, feel that shake. Four, three, two, and one, release. Whew, great job, everyone, let's stand up. Okay, so we're gonna focus on our quads first. So chair is here to help with balance. You're gonna face the chair or maybe your wall. We're gonna stand up onto our tippy toes, so heels off the floor. You're gonna bend the knees and lower. Okay, so elevated squat. 
shoulders right on top of those hips, just to then right on top of those heels. Find that spot. And we're gonna do a couple of slow movements, a couple of fast movements, just like our warm up. So go ahead and lift up nice and tall, shoulders right on top of those hips. We're gonna lower down for two and up for two. Down for two and up. You're gonna start to feel those legs shake. Your goal is to keep your chest up. Down, two, and up. So just a little bit of weight on that chair. We don't want to put all of our weight on it. Want to use the legs. Keep going. Now, if it becomes too much, you can always drop the heels. Let's do a couple more slow. Down, two, and lift. One more slow. So let's lower now for three counts. Three, two, one, lift up one. Three, two, one, lift up. Three, two, one, so a little harder there. Three, two, one, let's do one more time. Three, two, one, good. Lower, I want you to hold it at your lowest point. We're gonna pull, pull, pull. Little pulses. Woo, feel on those legs shake. Keep pulsing. Try to keep those heels off the floor. Keep pulsing. We have eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and come on up. Take it out. Good job. Okay, now we're gonna come into a diamond position. We're gonna open up from those hips. You want to glue your heels, glue those inner thighs together, and we're going to work the outsides of our legs. All right. So imagine you're zipping up the tech to your pants. Shoulder stack. Just a little bit of weight on this chair. Lift up to your highest point, heels together. Down, two, and up for two. Lower for two. You want to keep your heels together the whole time. Touch those hips under just a little bit. Down. For two. Up. Let's do a couple more. Down. And lift. You're going to feel those inner thighs and outer thighs shake. Make sure we're not gripping on the chair. It's just there for balance when we're slow. One more. Let's count. Lower three count. Three. Two. One. Lift up one. Ooh, so maybe get a little bit lower there. And again, if you need to, drop those heels, lower three, two, one, lift, three, two, one, couple more. Ooh, make sure you're still breathing. Last one, three, two, one, drop and hold, drop and hold, and lift it back up, do that again, drop and hold. Push those knees back, do it two more times, drop and hold. Lowest point, feel that burn, one more, drop and hold. Stay here, let's pull, pull, and pull. Woo, if you want that extra challenge, arms out in that beach ball. Imagine you're holding that beach ball. Keep going, I'm feeling that bird. Pull, pull, maybe arms up, final eight. Eight, seven, six, can you get a little lower? Four, three, two, one. Oh my goodness, it now. Great job. So quick quad stretch, then we're gonna hit glutes and hamstrings. Grab that foot, nice and tall, or you use your chair for it, right? Depending on your flexibility, hold that quick stretch, and then other side. Good job, everyone. So with bar, we burn out those muscle groups, and then we get that nice stretch after. All right, so let's get ready to hit hamstrings and glutes. So I do this with my arm, lean forward slightly. You always want a flat back here. And you might be familiar with some of those movements, like a donkey kick. You could do this on the floor, or even on your chair like this. Right, so whatever's more comfortable for you, I'm gonna start here and I'm gonna stay here. But feel free to adjust. 
Once we get going, we're gonna not gonna step. We're gonna do left leg first. Okay? Standing legs slightly bent. Three, two, we're gonna go two and two. Out, two, and in. Like you're pressing against the wall. Keep that foot, foot flat. One more at this pace. Now I want you to go tempo. So press, bring it back. Press, this is the small press. Touch those hips. Good. Like you're pressing your foot into a wall. Now we're gonna add a little kick. So you're gonna press, kick your heel. Press, kick your heel up. Press back, kick up, good. So what are you gonna feel mainly? Probably that standing leg, right? Woo! Keep going. Press, kick up. Press, kick up, two more. Okay, now we're gonna cross it around the back, a little mini lunge. Take it back up. Cross that knee behind the other knee and dip just a little bit. Down. Two. Like a curtsy lunge. Down. For two. Feel that glute working. Oh my goodness, we have one more. One more. And now you're just gonna pull. Pull, pull, pull. Pulse and lift. Pulse and lift. Woo! Pulse and lift. Small little pulses. Take that heel. Okay, now I want you to open up your hips. Point your toe. You're gonna lift up just a little bit. Stack like a side plank, knee to elbow. In for two and flex. Take it out. In for two and out. And again, you could adjust this. So maybe you're holding the chair like this. Make sure it's steady wherever you're at. Nice and slow. One more slow. In for two. What comes next? Tempo singles. We have eight and kick. Seven. Now it doesn't matter how high that leg is. Six. And five. Just bring it all the way in and out. Four. And three. Two. Last one. You're gonna keep it extended. Hold it here. Point your toe. Pull, pull, pull. Yeah, knee slightly bent. Eight. Seven. Six. Can you go a little higher? Three, two, one. Oh my goodness. Ooh, it's that standing leg is <laughs> the one you should be feeling. Like. Let's just do the other side, okay? Same thing, other side. Here we go. Take it out. Stack those forearms. Or you're straight down on that chair, whatever feels best for you. Right leg. Out for two and in. Nice flat back. Keep that foot flat. Out for two. Working into the other glute. So same sequence. Out for two and in. Out for two. So here comes that little kick with our heel. Out and kick. Out and kick. Out. The single count. I want you to bring your heel towards your glute. Imagine you're squeezing something underneath your knee. Four more. Four. Squeeze it. Three. A small movement. Now we're gonna cross it down and under. Down. First two. And up. Little crossover. Not quite going into a full lunge, just a little cross. You wanna reach that other knee. Yes. Nice and slow. Down. Woo! You should feel like you want to stop. That's where we got to keep going so we get stronger. Couple more. Down. For two. We're going to do one more slow. All right, you're just going to kick and pulse it out. Pull, pull. So it's a small little movement. Pull, pull, pull. Pull, pull, pull. So I know, keep that core nice and strong. You got to hit that heel. Eight, seven, little pulses, six, five, four, three. Now open up your hips, take your knees to your elbow. I know we're not done. In for two and out. Notice my leg is much lower on this side. That's okay, this one's a little weaker. Doesn't matter how high that leg is. In for two, just bring that knee to your elbow. 
Oh my goodness, standing leg. <laughs> Keep breathing out, one more slow. Let's try eight tempo. Eight. Seven. Six, come on. Five, you got this. Four. Three, three. Two, fill that shake, last one. Keep your leg extended. Pulse, pulse to finish. Pulse, pulse, pulse. So close, pulse, four. A little higher, three, two, one. Oh my goodness. Woo. Okay, so just gonna finish with four, but a quick stretch before we do that. You're gonna take that ankle, doesn't matter which one, cross it over that knee, figure four, or do this in your chair. Another reason we have our chair, <laughs> right? Nice stretch, get into those glutes, and then you're gonna switch, other side. We're gonna take it to the floor for core. Just about done. Get a nice little stretch. All right, let's take it to the floor. Those lightweights are optional. Everyone doing okay? Thumbs up, we're good. Okay, so weight's optional. I'm gonna start without them. You're gonna sit up nice and tall here. Think of drawing that belly button in towards your spine. Arms up, chest up. Inhale and exhale. Up, root two, and down, root two. Drum when you're ready. Up, root two, down, root two. Just lifting and lowering. Nice and slow. Lift up, two, and down. Lift up. Now find that point. You're halfway. You're gonna twist right, center, left, right. And left, right, left, nice and slow, right, left. So you want to draw that elbow back, keep your chest up, Whew. let's try two more, right and left, and left. Now I want you to twist to the right side, stay down nice and low, twist halfway, twist. Twist and twist. So the left shoulder is sort of creeping up with your twist. Stay on this side. Twist and twist. Lift that left shoulder. Maybe with or without those weights for eight, seven, like you're wringing out a towel. Five, four, three, two. Let's go to the other side. Same thing. It's a little twist and twist. That right shoulder lifting. Lean back as far as you can. Twist, twist. Keep going. Eight, seven, six. Working through those obliques. Four, three, two, and one. Lift all the way up and release. We're gonna finish in a plank position. Okay, so just like we did in the beginning, you can do that with your chair or take it to the floor a little harder on the floor. Onto your forearm. Four, three, two, hold your plank. Hold it right here. Keep it nice and strong right here. Just tuck those hips under. We're gonna drop the knees in just a second. We're gonna tap and lift. Tap and lift. Tap and lift. Tap without arching that back. Tap and lift. Tap the floor. Lift. Four. Three. Two. Last one. You're just gonna hold it. Hold it for eight counts. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. You got this. Four. Three. Two. And one. Knees down. And go ahead and stretch. Find that child's pose. Take a couple of breaths here. Relax that head in between your arms. And come up to tabletop. Quick cat cow. Inhale, drop the belly, lift the chest. And exhale, round the spine. Two more cat cows to finish up. Inhale and exhale.
Last cat cow, inhale and exhale. And then tuck the toes. Let's come into down dog. Final stretch, pedal out those heels. Press your chest towards your thighs. And then lower the knees to the floor. Roll it on up to standing. Couple of shoulder rolls at the top. All right. And then take a nice inhale, reach those arms up, big deep breath. Exhale, bend the knees, shake it out. One last time, inhale and exhale. Great job, everyone. Thanks for joining our mini workout that was far school. Um, let me know if you have any.